Hey y'all, I'm back and it's empties. It's October 2nd, season of the witch, and uh, I'm here with my September empties. This should be a pretty short video. I have uh, one, two, three, four categories, so let's get into it. Uh, the first category is bath and body care. I have two wrappers here from Bath Bomb. So um, had I known, I would have stocked up on bubble bath because bubble bath is not a thing here. Um, they do like perfumed water, but that, I like a bubble bath, so I've kind of been subsisting, nice word, with bath bombs. So this is a bath bomb energizing passion fruit. Anything with passion fruit, I will try once. Um, it's fine. I got it here. Goes in the trash can. I have my, my trash can right here. Happy to put things in the trash. And this is one that I brought from... Uh, the States, Shop Miss A, this is Botanist. This is the rosemary one. I liked this one, but it had actual pieces of rosemary in it. Um, so I felt like I was brewing in tea, which was cool, except for um, the pieces of rosemary got everywhere. So I don't think I would buy this one again, but it was a dollar, Shop Miss A. I've talked about them before. Um, so yay. On to uh, Pacifica. This is the Banana Love Deep Intensive Moisture Mask Hydration and Rehab for Big Time Damaged Hair. And that is my hair. Um, I hate my hair. Uh, I love Pacifica. I stocked up on a bunch of their stuff. It's on the boat. The boat docked in Rotterdam yesterday. So my stuff is in Europe. I should have it all by the end of the month. I can't wait to be reunited with my makeup and skincare because I'm weird I like that um I like this stuff I wish I could get it here uh this is 1.5 ounces and since I have short and real and thin hair I actually straightened my hair today uh but since I have short and thin hair I used I got two uses out of this um it's not something that I will you you know that I would use every single time I wash my hair I wash my hair two to three times a week um but I like this stuff and uh I wish I could get more of it Finally, I have one full-size sponge gel that was used. I don't know the scent, I call it flavor. I don't know the flavor, um, but I love these things. This one lasted me a solid month. Uh, so sponge gel, smells so good. Um, since I can't get the tea, uh, the tree hut, I think it's called, the tree hut uh, sugar scrub, these do well for exfoliating and I save my sh my sugar scrub for when I shave um, but these are great they have if you're not familiar with sponge gel they're they're sponges and they have the body wash in it so you know you wet it and it lasts about a month and it's just it's awesome and you can reuse these if you want but I have a million of them so into the trash it goes yay uh, next category is skincare uh this guy origins ginseng oil-free energy boosting gel moisturizer you guys have heard me talk about come on guy focus there it is you guys have heard me talk about this brand this is one of my favorite brands um this is just their moisturizer i loved it it's empty empty um i am pretty sure i have more of these on the boat can't wait to get more of them works great anything i try from this brand is wonderful um, they're a little on the pricey side, but they're not like Tatcha expensive. And I think that for the price, what you pay for is, is amazing. So I highly recommend Origins. Um, I have a little tiny, a lot of my stuff is tiny because I was traveling and all that. Um, I have a little tiny bottle of Sephora, the blue waterproof eye makeup remover. I like the blue stuff that you like, you know, shake up and it's dual action or whatever. Um, just your basic eye makeup remover. I mean, it was fine. I would buy it again if it was like super cheap, but nothing, nothing super special. It's just Sephora brand. That goes in the trash. Uh, this is a little bottle of Kinship Naked Papaya Gentle Enzyme Face Cleanser. I used this at night to take off my makeup after my, after taking off my, there you go, after taking off my eyeshadow and stuff. Um, Again, I had no problems with this. Would I search it out? Is it a holy grail for me? No, but I liked using it. It smells really good. Um, 
yeah, it smells really good. I am a big person on scent. Like if it does not smell good, I won't use it. Like pure, I don't care if it's like the best stuff on earth and it'll take whatever's going on here and make it, you know, I don't want my skin from when I was 20, it was awful. But you know, if it, if it will turn me into, you know, a supermodel, if it smells like butthole, I won't use it. So if it smells nice, um, that's half the battle. But good stuff. Well, I, you know, if it landed, if another one of these landed in my lap, I would use it. Am I gonna, am I gonna buy it? No. Uh, but this stuff, this I bought full size because this is one of my whole new holy grails. This is the, this is a little trial size. This is the Awake Power After Hour 2% Retinol Complex. Um, this is, I use this on Sundays and Wednesdays, and it's a facial oil. It's 2% retinol. Um, it smells like Thai food, which I dig. And uh, this stuff is amazing. I love this stuff. If you don't like facial oils, you probably won't like this, but um, just, it comes in a dropper, or you know, this is just, oh, it smells so good. This, you know, you just put a little tiny bit on your hand and then don't rub. You just kind of, and then pat, 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 pat. And it's retinol, so retinol is your, you know, secret skincare power ingredient. And uh, I just, you know, I found the retinol that I like. And Awake is Tarte's skincare brand. Who would have thunk, right? Um, so I have a couple more of these little tiny baby bottles, but I also bought a full size. And I will continue to buy this in full size because this is the retinol that my skin likes. So, yay. Uh, so I finished one of those. Uh, finished a couple of little tiny baby fragrance. This is the Jo Malone peony and blush suede it's all right it's a little old ladyish for me i finished it i liked it would i buy it no Jo malone's way too expensive uh and then this is uh gucci blue this i would buy gucci bloom profumo di fiori i don't speak italian profumo di fiori hey uh this i would there's a tiny bit i'm gonna spray it no there's not a tiny bit no oh, oh there it goes oh this I would buy. Um, the Gucci Bloom is actually cheaper in Europe. It's like 50 euro. That's way cheaper than it is in the States. So once I start working again, I'm going to buy me a full size bottle of this for whatever, Christmas, Hanukkah. Um, yeah, Gucci Bloom, one of my favorites. And then finally, we have some makeup that we finished or that I'm calling it, it's dead. Um, I could probably get some more use out of the Big Papa, but I got other ones to use, so. I mean, this looks good. Like, is it my favorite? No. Is it good? Yeah, especially for a drugstore mascara. I don't buy expensive mascara anymore. Um, there was a point in time where I used to buy expensive, you know, Tarte Benefit mascara, and that works fine too, if that's your thing. Um, but this was $5, and it works good, if not better. My favorite mascara is from Essence and I actually just started using their Bye Bye Panda Eyes today again and it does the trick. Um, so yeah, good, great. I mean, I would use it again. Am I gonna go searching for it here? No, I can get Essence Mascara here. So that's what I'll use. Uh, this sh Tarte Shape Tape Glow Wand, uh, it was time to call it. I liked it, it's time to move on. Um, as you can see, I kind of, scrape the edges there. Um, I used this more as like a really glowy moisturizer, uh, not moisturizer, glowy foundation. Uh, but then like it worked in the summer when it was hot, but then you know, it's starting to cool down here and I used it a couple times this week and I was like, I look like a grease ball. It's time to kill it. Um, it was good. If I could find this again on the cheap, I wouldn't pay full price for it, especially here because Tarte is expensive here. Um, this was in the shade Sunbeam. I think I got this in a boxy, it's full size good stuff um I actually have one more left and I don't think we had any like ew knows this month uh finally this is the poor professional super setter this is a little tiny bottle again benefit I think I got this off of a friend for like two or three dollars would never pay full price for it but it did the trick nothing special my makeup stayed smells fine I like it I, again, wouldn't buy full size, but if I could get another little tiny baby bottle of this, I would. 
nothing terrible this month. Very nice. Um, I don't think I'm going to be finding many terrible things uh, in my collection that I already had because I, my, like my existing collection is pretty curated. I knew what I had and I knew what I liked and I sold a lot of the stuff that I didn't like because I wasn't going to bring it over here. But as I buy stuff over here, I already have a couple of things that I don't like. Um, so maybe once I get some more of that, um, we can talk about that. I don't know what I'm going to do with it quite yet. I might send it to my mom and my sister and be like, hey, look, cool Spanish, Portuguese stuff. Um, but for the most part, my empties are going to be stuff that I, you know, most part enjoy. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this relatively short video. Um, like, subscribe, Instagram, Sparkle Jezebel. Um, play this in the background. Play it on mute. I don't care. Give me those, give me those uh, plays. And I will see you soon. Bye.